Hi everyone, this is Anne. Today I have five July beauty favorites to share with you. Welcome back to my channel, and if you're new, welcome. I hope that you enjoy my videos, and if you do, I would love it if you subscribe to my channel. As always, I'll list and link all of the products that I show down in the description box beneath this video, and I'll also put them in the first pinned comment under this video so that they're really easy to find. These are in no particular order. I'm going to start out with a self tanner and I love gradual tanning lotions and I started using one about a month ago that I absolutely love. It has quickly become my all time favorite because it just gives the prettiest natural glow to your skin. It's by Saint Tropez and this is their gradual tanning everyday body lotion. I have mine a medium dark and if you have lighter skin than I do I would suggest using the light medium. I can use that one in the winter time. I originally bought it and it wasn't quite enough color for summer time for me but I think in the winter that would be great and then the medium dark in the fall, spring, and summer for me. I use mine once or twice a week just for a nice glow and a little bit of color to my skin. I love that this is streak free. It has no color guide. It is a thicker white lotion. It is a moisturizing body lotion. You can use it every day. I don't do that because I don't want to be too dark, so I just use it once or twice a week, and it fades off beautifully. It's not patchy at all when it fades off. And it also does not have the typical self-tanning scent. It just has a nice clean scent to it. I absolutely love this product and if you haven't tried it and are looking for just a nice touch of color to your skin, I would definitely recommend this. It's a great product. Another beauty favorite that I've been loving recently is a long wear lip color and this is by L'Oreal. It's their Pro Last 2-in-1 lip color. It has a highly pigmented color on one end and then it has a clear balm that is moisturizing on the other end and it helps to lock in the color. It wears beautifully. I can eat and drink and I still have color left on my lips and when it does fade it fades off nice and evenly. It's not patchy as it fades and it almost just stains my lips. My very favorite color shade is 111 which is Passionate Petal. It's a really pretty kind of a rosy shade almost like a your lips but better shade and it has just a touch of peach to it so it's it's very brightening on my face and I absolutely love this color and this product. My next favorite is a hair oil. This is Tiki Tahiti Minoy Oil. It's a coconut based oil and I use it to soften my hair. I do have dry color treated hair. This works great in my hair. It, it moisturizes it. It leaves it soft and manageable. And how I like to use this is I put one to two drops mixed in with my leave-in conditioner before I style my hair. And it just really makes a huge difference in the health of my hair. Plus this product smells absolutely Absolutely amazing. I have the coconut scent which I really love and then I also always buy the vanilla scent which they both smell amazingly good and they work great. If you have dry hair it's a great way to incorporate some moisture into your hair just by adding one to two drops to your leave-in conditioner. A few additional ways I like to use Minoy oil is sometimes I'll remove my makeup at nighttime with it or I'll add a few drops to my body lotion and it makes my lotion smell amazing plus it's very hydrating on the skin. Another hair care product favorite of mine lately are these little clips and these will not bend or crease your hair so they're great to use after you've already styled your hair and I like to use them to help set my style. So if I want my hair going forward, say for instance, I just clip it forward and then I leave it for about 10 to 15 minutes and when I let it out, it just helps shape your hair. So you can help create a curl in your hair 
or you can put them up in the crown of your hair to help create more volume in the crown of your hair. Also, if you're going to apply makeup, they're great to hold back your hair if you have bangs and you want to keep your hair off of your face while you apply your makeup. And the best thing about them is they won't leave little crease marks in your hair. So these are definitely a favorite product for me for styling my hair and a skincare product that I have been absolutely obsessed with for the last month, month and a half, are micro-infused facial patches. And these are just little patches that have dissolvable cones filled with skincare. And when you peel off the little sticker around the edge, you place it on either around your mouth, on the lines around your mouth, or underneath your eyes and then you place it on clean skin at nighttime, you press it into your skin, those tiny little cones filled with product go into your skin and dissolve, releasing the product into your skin. And they work great to plump up your skin overnight, so they're a great product to use if you have an event, to use them the night before so that you have nicely plumped skin. Also, they do work over time to help build new collagen within your skin. I like to use them weekly, and my two favorite types are either peptide and hyaluronic acid patches or growth factor and hyaluronic acid patches because the growth factors and the peptides do help to build new collagen within your skin over time. And I'll link both types of those patches down beneath this video in the description box as well as in that first pinned comment. I hope you enjoyed seeing my July Beauty favorites. If you've tried any of these products or are interested in any of them, please comment below and share your thoughts on them. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it.